Hey everyone, it's Ellen. I'm here to talk about something that really matters. Let's talk about something really important, sexual harassment. It's an issue that affects countless individuals every day. It's a big problem that affects too many people, and we need to talk about it openly. By discussing it, we can start to make a change. Everyone deserves to feel safe and respected, whether it's at work, at school, or anywhere else. No one should have to endure harassment. It's not okay for someone to make you feel uncomfortable or unsafe because of your gender or sexuality. This behavior is unacceptable. We need to stand up for ourselves and for each other. Supporting one another is crucial in creating a safer environment. If you see something, say something. Reporting incidents can help prevent further harm. Let's create a world where everyone feels safe and respected. Together, we can build a community based on mutual respect and understanding. Remember, you're not alone, and there are resources to help. Reach out to support groups and organizations dedicated to assisting those affected. Let's work together to make a difference. By joining forces, we can create lasting change and ensure a safer future for everyone. So, what exactly is sexual harassment? It's any unwanted sexual advance or behavior that makes you feel uncomfortable, offended, or threatened. This can include a lot of different things, like making sexually suggestive jokes or comments, unwanted touching, hugging, or kissing, spreading rumors about someone's sex life, showing sexually explicit pictures or videos, and making demands for sexual favors, especially in a work or school setting. Remember, it's never okay for someone to make you feel this way. You have the right to say no, and you have the right to report it. Did you know that there are laws to protect you from sexual harassment? It's true. These laws are designed to ensure that everyone can work in a safe and respectful environment. In the United States, Title VII of the Civil Rights Act of 1964 says that it's illegal to discriminate against someone based on their sex. This landmark legislation was a major step forward in the fight for equality and civil rights. This means that you can't be harassed at work because of your gender. Harassment can take many forms, including unwelcome sexual advances, requests for sexual favors, and other verbal or physical harassment of a sexual nature. This law applies to all employers with 15 or more employees. It ensures that workplaces are held to a standard that promotes fairness and equality. It covers things like hiring, ensuring that everyone has an equal opportunity to be considered for a job, firing, making sure that terminations are not based on discriminatory reasons, promotions, pay, and other employment terms. And yes, even the work environment. A positive and inclusive work environment is essential for productivity and employee well-being. So, if you're being sexually harassed at work, you have the right to file a complaint with your employer or with the Equal Employment Opportunity Commission, also known as the EEOC. The EEOC is there to help you navigate the process and ensure your rights are protected. Section 4. New York State and City Laws. Extra Layers of Protection. Now, if you live in New York State, you have even more protection. The state has taken significant steps to ensure that all residents feel safe and secure. New York State's human rights law and New York City's human rights law are even stronger than federal law. These laws are designed to provide comprehensive protection against discrimination. They cover more employers, even those with fewer than 15 employees. This means that smaller businesses are also held accountable for maintaining a fair and inclusive environment. These laws also protect you from discrimination based on your sexual orientation and gender identity. They ensure that everyone, regardless of who they love or how they identify, is treated equally. That means you can't be harassed for being gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender, or anything in between. The laws are there to safeguard your rights and dignity. You deserve to be treated with respect no matter what. Everyone has the right to a workplace free from discrimination and harassment. 
Section 5. Retaliation is illegal. Speaking up is your right. Okay, so you've been harassed, and you're thinking about reporting it. But what if your boss or co-workers retaliate? Don't worry, the law protects you there too. It's illegal for someone to punish you for reporting sexual harassment or for participating in an investigation. Retaliation can include things like being fired, demoted, or given a bad schedule. It can also include being bullied or harassed even more. If this happens to you, report it immediately. The law is on your side. Section 6. Prevention is key mandatory training in New York. New York State is serious about preventing sexual harassment. That's why they've made it mandatory for all employers to provide annual sexual harassment prevention training to their employees. This training helps everyone understand what sexual harassment is and how to prevent it. It also teaches employees how to report harassment if it happens. This training is so important because it helps create a safer and more respectful workplace for everyone. Section 7. Taking Action. Know Your Rights. Speak Out. Sexual harassment is a serious issue, but we can all do our part to stop it. Knowledge is power. Learn about your rights and the resources available to you. If you experience or witness sexual harassment, speak up. Report it to your supervisor, HR department, or the appropriate authorities. Don't be afraid to stand up for yourself and others. Together, we can create a world where everyone feels safe, respected, and empowered. Remember, you're not alone. As we wrap up, let's summarize the key points we've discussed in this video. Sexual harassment is a serious issue that affects many individuals in the workplace. It's crucial to understand what constitutes harassment and know your rights under Title VII. Remember, there are extra layers of protection available, and speaking up is your right. In New York, mandatory training ensures that everyone is informed and prepared to handle these situations. Knowing your rights and speaking out is essential to creating a safe and respectful environment for all. If you experience or witness sexual harassment, take action. Report it to your supervisor, HR department, or the appropriate authorities. Don't hesitate to stand up for yourself and others. For further information and support, here are some resources. The Equal Employment Opportunity Commission, EEOC. Local Human Rights Commissions. Workplace Harassment Hotlines. Together, we can make a difference and foster a workplace where everyone feels safe, respected, and empowered. Remember, you're not alone. Let's take action and support each other in creating a better world. Thank you for joining us today. For more information and resources, please visit the Sanders Firm PC website. Stay informed. Stay safe.